Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions, and thank you for your time together today. Great services, all three campuses. Brother John is doing what we call the spin at COP. He's going to be bringing a tremendous sermon on growing together. And we got jackfruit seeds that we're going to plant together. And these jackfruit trees are later going to be planted out on a property in Tanawan where we're building the new radio tower. And it's just going to be a great time together. Right now, I want us to go back to the book of Numbers, or excuse me, Hebrews. Hebrews chapter 11, verse 15. Well, let's back up to verse oh, 14. People who say such things show that they're looking for a country of their own. If they had been thinking of the country they had left, they would have had opportunity to return. Instead, they were longing for a better country, a heavenly one. Therefore, God is not ashamed to be called their God, for he has prepared a city for them. Now, I want you to notice, brothers and sisters, the, the longing of your heart is how faith is often expressed. But also, the thoughts of your mind are also what attracts opportunities to our lives. People talk a lot about the law of attraction today. Well, I'm not sure about the law of attraction, but I do understand about the power of the human mind and, and what the human mind can accomplish. When you start thinking about things all the time, opportunities present themselves. Let me say that again. Opportunities present themselves. If they had been thinking of the country they had left, they would have had an opportunity to return. When the cry of your heart is reaching for something, there's opportunities that the devil always makes sure he brings to pass in front of your life. I teach young men, don't think about your old girlfriend, fix your thoughts upon your wife. I teach people that have started a business, don't think about that secure job you had in the past, focus your thoughts on your business. I teach young men and young women that have followed the call of God in their life, don't think about your past career, don't think about those people before, don't, don't think about the past life, focus on where you're going, not where you've come from. Because if you let your heart, if you let the thoughts of your heart dwell on where you've come from, Satan will always bring opportunities for you to go back. I want to challenge you today. Think about your future. Don't think about your past. Think about the future with your wife. Don't think about your old college girlfriend and you looked her up on Facebook and then your mind and your heart starts going back. Don't, don't look to the past. Keep yourself focused on where you're going. That's what bring, will bring opportunities for your future. If you focus your heart on the past, Satan will bring you opportunities from your past.